What is going on guys? Nick here and welcome to finally another Nick is now trying and this one is of True or False which recently came out on Steam for free. Uh, in that l update video I did, the channel update, I said I wanted to get back to doing Nick is now trying and I wanted to do more free games and lo and behold this game came out the day I made that update video. And I'm confused as to why it's on Steam, so I'm gonna play it. I'm not expecting a ton, but let's just let's just jump in and see kind of what happens. The only options really are the sound. You can click this up here, which looks to me originally looked like oh it's gonna give you like options menu. No, it just takes you back to the beginning. You lost, and you can you can pause the music that repeats. But <laughs> there's not a lot happening. It's a Unity game. It had that at the uh, the beginning. But uh, let's just let's give it a try. See if I can get these these facts going. Michael B. Jordan's father name is named Michael A. Jordan. I don't think that's right. Yeah. Okay. Oh my God, that is right. Well, shit. I came in here not expecting much, and I fucked up the first question. Let's do it again. In Japan, there's a belief that if umbrella if the umbrella long enough lies idle, it becomes a one-eyed and one-legged hopping. Hopping demon can't read apparently That sounds kind of like an anime thing, so I'm kind of gonna say yeah. Oh Thank God, okay, we got one. I want to get to ten. I feel like I could do it green eye color is the rarest color found around the world as someone with green eyes I think that's true because I think blue is more common I'm trying to think hazel is definitely not. I mean, I guess you're counting like yellow I'm gonna say true Okay, yeah, I thought so. Alright, cool. Let's see. Catholic Bishop described the birth of the universe in an explosion seven centuries before the Big Bang Theory. Uh, I feel like a Catholic Bishop wouldn't... I'm gonna say false? God damn it! <laughs> I, that, I felt like that was like too specific to be wrong kind of thing. But I just, it didn't seem right. Let's see, a man bought 365 Starbucks cards, registered each one for a different birthday, so he got a free birthday drink every day of the year. That sounds like some shit someone would do, especially living near San Francisco. Absolutely. Yep, <laughs> I had to be correct. Okay. Okay, La Cucaracha is a song about a cockroach. That doesn't sound... I don't think so, it's too dancey. Fuck, how... <laughs> Why am I so bad at this? Oh, uh, that's annoying. I'm actually, I'm not gonna lie, already I'm having way more fun in this than I thought I was going to. So I guess that's good. Let's see, candy sales dropped 28% after the movie The Social Network was released. What the fuck does that have to do with candies, and why is the quotations at the bottom? That's weird. Um, that sounds so specific. But what would trigger that? I never saw the social network, so I don't know if there's something in there. I'm gonna say false. Okay. <laughs> Let's see. Scorpion Venom is the most expensive liquid on Earth. Go with no, because I feel like something like liquid gold or like oil <laughs> is more expensive. Wow, it is? What the hell? Okay, let's... <laughs> now I'm like, it's bringing out my competitive nature. I haven't made it past, what, three? Let's see. The Great Wall of China is the only human man-made object visible from the moon. I think that's true, actually. Fuck me! <laughs> Why am I so bad at trivia? Oh my god. Alabama has redefined Pi to 3.0 to bring it in line with biblical values. Fuck, that wouldn't surprise me. Huh. I'm gonna say false, because I don't think they'd go that far. I don't think... It... That can't be right. Okay. <laughs> okay, I like that this is like even the wrong ones make it sound, you know, kind of right. Mark Wahlberg served 45 days in jail for attempted murder. He wouldn't serve 45 days in jail for it. I'm gonna say false. Wow, he was? What the hell, Mark Wahlberg? Cat, can you get out of here? Okay, <laughs> this is crazy. I want one... I want to at least get to five, right? I don't know how long I'm going to play this for. I came in here thinking this was going to be garbage, and I'm actually having a good time. 
Let's see. Okay, so we already saw. Okay, so that's kind of bad. We're already getting repeats. And we've done only a handful of. I was gonna say eggs, but games. Um, U.S. eggs would be a little illegal in the British supermarket because they are washed. British eggs are illegal in the U.S. markets because they're unwashed. I know there are some stuff that like is legal there, or because of the shit we put into food here, but eggs. I'm gonna go true. Okay, <laughs> we're up to three. Let's do it. When asked what his IQ was, Stephen Hawking says, I have no idea. People who boast about their IQs are losers. Something tells me that it's true. I feel, oh my god. I feel like that's something Stephen Hawking's, maybe not in that, co like the, the thing I'm having an issue with is the way it's said. I could see him being like above, have, like doing an IQ test, but <sighs> I'm gonna go true. Yes! Okay, we're up to four. New record, boys. Alright, Rembrandt students parked him, pranked him, parked him, pranked him by painting fake coins on the floor to watch him try to pick them up. I don't know who Rembrandt is. Which is probably my own ignorance. Huh. I'm gonna have to go false god damn it it's again it's one of those ones where it's too specific to be wrong halo 3 inspired Bill Gates to invent okay come on really get out of here halo get out of here bears will not attack you if they can't see your eyes part of me wants to think that's true because the whole playing dead thing hmm I'm gonna say true. Oh fuck. <laughs> I don't know. And I'm even in a place, well, I guess not immediately, but I've been camping many times where bears are. Okay, so this one's true. So again, running into, running out of questions quick here. Lord of the Rings was originally based on a cereal box character. No, that's not true at all. Let's see, the last king of Greece, Constantine II, won Greece's first Olympic gold medal since 1912 in the 1960 Summer Olympics. Hmm. I feel like a king wouldn't be a super athlete. <laughs> like, I, I mean, that might be, I, I guess it's not really stereotyping, but like, when you think of a king, you don't think of like, a Usain Bolt type, you know? So I'm gonna say false. God fucking damn it! Why am I so bad? All right, we're gonna go again, damn it. The man who created the modern American flag did so for a high school, but no, that's not true. What, that was true? That's fucking crazy. And people are butthurt, Kaepernick's not standing up for it. Get out of here. All right, <laughs> Harvard earned so much money on interest from its endowment that it could offer free tuition to all students and still make profit on the interest. I think that's true. That sounds like something that's true, yeah. Penguins are the only known animals to fly with no one looking. No, I don't think they fly at all. Okay, yeah. That would be a great thing though, if that was just an actual thing. Okay, this one was true. Once again, we're getting into that repeat zone. Dogs eat, I think that is true. I think I've seen something about that before. Yeah. Which is really fucking sad, because like it's sad already if someone has PTSD, but dogs are such like innocent creatures. That's really sad to get PTSD. Uh, body, yeah, that's true. What? That's not true? I always thought that shit was true. I've been lied to my entire life. God damn it. <sighs> I'm getting irritated. <laughs> I hate that this is happening. The Chesnick Republic have over 1,500 people who religiously identify as a Jedi Knight. I feel like that would be true if it was America, but I don't know about the Chesnick Republic, because uh, I'm going to go false. Wow, really? I mean, good for them, you know, find what you believe in, I guess, <laughs> but oh my god. Bicycles have no speed limit in the UK, but you can get charged with cycling furiously. That sounds like, yeah, that sounds like a European thing. 
Okay. Not that that's bad, just here we're like, oh, you can't go too fast, wear a fucking helmet. You know. Yeah, anyway. <laughs> Only two species had domesticated other species, humans and ants. I feel like the ants make sense. I think. I feel like that's like a, that would be a common thing with. Ah, uh, that sounds like true. Yeah. Okay. okay. Let's see. Heidi and Liechtenstein had the same exact. Oh, Haiti. <laughs> Heidi. I read Liechtenstein, and thought, oh, it's gonna be like European, but no, it's Haiti. I'm a fucking idiot. Had the same exact. I don't know what the Haiti flag looks like. Um, let's see, Haiti is in a part of the world that was colonized, so it's possible? Yeah, okay. I don't know if my reasoning's right on that, but hey, I got it right. Pigs are incredibly scared of the sound of cats meowing. <sighs> I'm gonna go false. That doesn't sound like... It's true. Okay. Phew. Okay, Norway will be the first country in the world to shut down FM radio signal and go digital. That sounds like something one of the Nordic countries would do. And that's not a bad thing. Like, those countries are fucking great with a lot of the shit they do. Some of them, not so much in some racial issues and shit like that, but for, like, their progression in tech and stuff, it's pretty good. So I'll say, yeah. Okay, yeah. For it. King Henry VIII? Yeah. Slept with a gigantic axe. God, that fucking sounds like something a king would do. But I, I'm thinking like Game of Thrones, not actual kings. Um, I don't know anything about King Henry VIII. Slept with a giant axe. That sounds too vague. Like, if it was more specific, maybe. I'm gonna go false. Okay, whew. Come on, let's get this 10. Let's do it. Wild bananas are full of seeds. The ones we eat have been specifically... Yes, I believe that is true. Yeah, okay. Come on, boys, we got this. Oh, shit. Every night, state's president with a beard has been Republican. Oh god, um, I'm trying to think of one that was Democrat. Um, I think that might be true. Yeah, I think that might be true. Okay, oh my god, come on, let me do this. In Mexico, artists pay their taxes using artwork that they create. There's no way, right? <laughs> like, I don't think so. God, don't screw me over at nine. No, come on. Come on. Fucking tease. We're going again, damn it. Okay, so that's true. So, okay, so aside from just playing the game obviously I gotta critique a little bit I, I like the simple style and if, it, if I had to pay for this I would never touch it um, it's definitely entertaining but it doesn't look like there's a huge selection of questions which is worrying because you know then it gets old really quick let's see people thought the world was flat before Columbus I mean people thought both ways though like there were people who thought it was flat and there were people who thought it was round so, you, technically that's true? Oh, fuck off. Wait, by Columbus this time, were they all fully aware it was a circle? Or a sphere? I don't know. Part of me wants to say this is true, only based off of that Pokemon from Pokemon Black. That's the only thing I'm basing this off of, because I feel like they'd model that after something real. And I was right. Okay. Uh, Aaron Paul and Brian Cranston both got tattoos together when Breaking Bad ended. 
I don't know if that's true or not. I actually never watched Breaking Bad. I watched like half, the first season and then I just kind of fell off. But that sounds like something they would do. Yeah. Okay. Albert Einstein was offered the presidency of Israel, but turned it down. Hmm. I kind of want to go true, and I don't know why, because I feel like that's something I would have learned at some point. <laughs> I'm going to go false. God damn it! I should have went with my initial gut instinct. Alright, Czech Republic. Okay, that's true. So again, not to harp on it, but that's becoming a pro problem. Jim Morrison was first person to assassinate a king of England. That's... no. Yeah. <laughs> that's not right at all. The most frequently used word in the English language is biscuit. That can't be right. Right. No, it has to be something like the, <laughs> or a. Yeah, okay, there's no way, that's too specific. There's a 42% decrease in air quality throughout the U.S. on 4th of July as a result of firework displays. God, would it really decrease it by 42% though? I'm gonna say that's false, it sounds like it's too high. Oh, fuck me, of course. I just want to hit 10, damn it. Body heat. Okay, that found out that one's false. Yep. Oh my god. Uh, that one's true? That's kind of worrying me that we got two back to back. Julius Pringles. Julius Pringle. Why would it be Julius? I'm trying to think if there's like a reason it would be Julius. Now that I'm thinking about it, it sounds right. <laughs> I don't know. I'm gonna go true. Fuck it. Hey! I don't know why his name's Julius, but you know. There's rare sleeping disorder that causes people to sleep for weeks at a time, waking only to eat. I feel like that might be true. Yeah, okay. I felt like it's one of those things that were sounded real enough to where I'm sure that it being rare. The film The Godfather is shot in backwards. What the fuck does that even mean? <laughs> um, did they mean chronologically backwards? Like, they shot the end first and then the first or the beginning last? God, this is gonna irritate me because I feel like this is one of those stupid things that are gonna be true. Oh no, thank God. Okay. Alright, polar bear's liver has a toxic amount of vitamin A in it, so consuming it will make you sick or kill you. That wouldn't shock me if that was true, so I'm gonna say true. Okay, yeah. Okay, there's a tree that can grow 40 different kinds of fruit. I'm gonna say false, because I don't... No, if that's how fruit works. Fuck. Okay, well we're coming up on 20 minutes, so I'm gonna do one more and then give some final thoughts. <laughs> Let's see, molecular, molecular, molecularly speaking. Oh my god, water is actually much drier than sand. What the fuck does dryness have to do with molecules? False. Okay, yeah, I felt like that didn't make sense. There's a chocolate scented flower. That has to be true, right? Yeah. Okay, other than men, the elk is the only animal that celebrates birthdays? No. Doesn't sound right. Yeah, okay. <laughs> like, if anything, it might be monkeys, but no. The British Army has almost twice as many horses as it does tanks. See, my first thought was that could be true. But no. But at the same time, they're waterlocked. So they don't necessarily need that many tanks. So when you have a small amount of tanks, it makes it easier to have more horses because you can get more horses for a tank. I don't know. Fuck, I'm going to say true. 
Yes! Okay. <laughs> Let's see. YouTube servers cost $29 a month to run. God, this is one of those stupid fucking things that, like, it sounds like it's way too low to be true, but I could totally see it being true. I'm gonna go true. Fuck it. Oh, damn it. Okay, well, you know what? That is enough. Enough true or false for me for this. I mean, it's, it's, there's not a whole lot more to do. But, to be honest, and this is like, my final thought, this game was much better than I thought it would be. Um, I originally saw it and was like, oh, someone threw a game together in, you know, beginning programming class and, you know, put it out on Steam for free. Um, but it was actually much funner than I thought it would be. It, it had that like, it give you that competitive adrenaline where you're like, no, I need to get better, and so you keep doing it. Because, like, by the end, I was just instinctively hitting play every single time I failed. So, I mean, I think it has that going for it. I think something huge, though, is in the... I don't know how many games I've played. I probably saw maybe 100 questions, if that. Um, and I got repeats pretty often after the first couple games. Um, this one's definitely going to need more just questions. And I think some of the false questions are, like... Come on. Like, the one where it's like Halo 3 inspired the internet. Like, there's no way. Like, that's too obviously false. Like, I, I I understand having some easy questions, but since I'm assuming there's no, like, oh, the first couple are easy, the last couple, or the medium, the in the middle ones are medium difficulty and the last ones are hard, it just feels like they're randomly distributed. Ones like that don't really fit because it feels like just throwaways. Um. But outside of that, I won't lie, this was way more fun than I thought it would be. It was more fun. It, I had more fun going into this. Or I had more fun playing this than I originally anticipated. I thought it was just going to be like a stupid little, you know, thing I'd do for, you know, 10 minutes. But I got 20 minutes of, like, straight up enjoyment out of it. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, I think, I mean, if you're into... If you're into trivia, and you have Steam, because that's the only requirement for this, and I actually think, on the Steam page, it says you can get this DRM free, so I'm assuming you could Google true or false and find it. Um, but yeah, if you're into trivia, and you got a little bit of time to kill, uh, I think this is actually quite fun, for as simplistic and stuff as it is. I suck at trivia, apparently, but it's totally, totally fun. And I, two thumbs up, for sure. Well, no, I'll go one thumb up for now, two if they add more questions. <laughs> I think that's how I'll, I'll rate this game. It, given I don't, this isn't meant to be rating, it's just, you know, I'm a fan. And I'll, I'll actually keep this in my Steam library, because if it gets updated, I do want to play it. Uh, and I could totally see myself playing this while I'm like, you know, waiting for shit to happen in World of Warcraft or uploading a video or something. But yeah, regardless, totally fun. True or false, on Steam, link will be in the description below if you would like to play it. And yeah, thank you guys for watching. If you have any free-to-play games, either on Steam or on something like Desura or on its own website that you would like me to do and Nick is now trying, please let me know in the comments below.